Now, apparently this device right here can improve anxiety, reduce stress, improve concentration, and improve the depth and the quality of your sleep. Now, if it can do that, then it will definitely make you happier and healthier. But can it actually do that? This is the Pulsetto, a brand new, non-invasive vagus nerve stimulation device. And I've been using it for the past two weeks. And in this video, I'm gonna discuss the science. And I'm gonna share with you the results to see if it actually does work. And if it does work, as far as I'm concerned, this is huge news. If this device can be used as an alternative to medications and pharmacological treatment for stress, anxiety, and things like depression, and increasing concentration, then I'm sold. First of all, who am I? I'm Dr. Daniel. Olaya. I'm a clinical lecturer and an anesthetist or anesthesiologist for those of you who are American in specialty training in central London. I've been a doctor for eight years and I'm serious about fitness, pushing human physiology to its limits and I'm extremely passionate about research and finding out how we can live healthier and higher quality lives. So I first got excited about this when I saw Brian Johnson, the world famous biohacker who said great things about it. But for me personally, stress and my poor sleep is my weakness. Night shift international travel for work, adrenaline rushes, and studying for exams, that they're not healthy and they decrease the quality of my life. So when I got to review this, I was genuinely excited. But first, let's get to the basics. To understand the significance of this device, we need to know about the vagus nerve, which runs from your brain all the way down to your large intestine. And it's actually the longest cranial nerve in your body. The vagus nerve is the most important one in the parasympathetic nervous system. This is classically known as the red and digest system. It plays an important part in digestion, heart rate, blood pressure, immune responses, mood, mucus and saliva production, speech, taste and urine output. Basically, it plays a part in everything. So let's look at some actual research now. In 2017, we had the review of non-invasive vagus nerve stimulation, the gamma core, which is a different device, looking at the efficacy, safety, potential impact on comorbidities and the economic burden, specifically looking at chronic cluster headaches. So that would be pain. And it was was based on this research that the FDA approved external vagus nerve stimulation for these headaches and for pain. So the FDA provided another piece of research which is much more convincing. I quote, according to this meta-analysis, we conclude that transcutaneous vagus nerve stimulation is an effective and safe treatment for mild to moderate depression with comparable efficacy to antidepressants. However, practitioners and healthcare professionals should be cautious with the results since the quality of evidence is low to very low evidence. More evidence is needed. Now, my opinion on this is that it's good that we have some research here, but of course, no research is perfect. And it's important to look at every piece of research critically as a medical professional and as a scientist. So the external vagus nerve stimulation works. Before we dive into our experiment, let's take a closer look at the science behind it. Welcome to my laboratory, AKA my bedroom. For this scientific experiment with the Pulsetto, we acquired quantitative and qualitative measurements. The quantitative measurements measurements were my blood pressure, my heart rate, and my sleep statistics according to my Garmin Phoenix 6. And the qualitative measurements were how I was feeling on a scale of 1 to 5, calm and relaxed to very stressed, 1 to 5. Every day at 10 p.m. I would have one session and I would set it to the sleep session and then I would go to sleep shortly afterwards. The control experiment was the same thing but this time I used deep breathing exercises and calm music before I fell asleep. I measured my blood pressure and heart rate 10 minutes before having the pulsetto and 10 minutes after having the pulsetto treatment. Now let's discuss the results of the experiment. Now before we reveal the results, it's very important to disclose that pulsetto have provided me with this device for free to review and to test and they paid for my time in which to do this because making these videos does take a long time. But despite this, I have a professional obligation and a personal obligation to present factual and unbiased information. And I would only tell you to use this if I was happy using it myself. So without further ado, let's actually see what the results told us. The qualitative data that I collected was a questionnaire. And on each of the 14 days that I used the Pulsetto, I felt better 
I felt more calm I felt more relaxed after whether that was confounded by the fact that all of a sudden I was using this time to really relax to really be calm and I wanted the falsetto to work so that probably had an effect on things and even in the control group each time I relaxed and did the breathing meditation I felt better and I felt more relaxed afterwards but with the falsetto group there was a drop in my systolic blood pressure which potentially means something as a medical professional it's important to discuss the side effects which there are in every single medical device these are rare but they include fainting headache heart palpitations itching the redness nausea and vomiting having a sore throat tickling and prickliness against the skin and having a hoarse voice again this device is generally considered safe but it's important to mention these the serious side effects are of course infrequent but it is crucial to use the device as directed so in conclusion the pulsetto as an external vagus nerve stimulator has shown promising results in my experiments which i did on myself on the days that i did it for me actually worked physiologically and, and how i felt managing stress anxiety and improving my sleep despite the fact that i was on night shifts as well i'm genuinely excited about the possibilities of, of this technology in the future honestly kind of mind blown by the price of this and the fact that it's so safe and the fact that it works and it's available to everyone thank you for joining me on this journey having a look at this and i'm going to be doing more videos and checking out more pieces of tech and doing more biohacking so please subscribe like share this video and join me on the journey let's have some fun